Howdy y'all, I'm around the wheel, you're watching 46 Okanen, and a little bit of business to cover before we go into Disc 3. I forgot to go back to the Anubisaurus Forest Guardian last time. He said he wanted to be notified after you prevented the desertification of the forest. And But I went back to him, so I went back to him, and turned out it wasn't really anything of any real consequence. So I decided not to include it. So we're just going to move straight into Disc 3, which contains Chapter 3, which is... The Death Star Era. I thought we were moving into the Age of Reptiles. Here's 20 Evo genes, kids. Go see a Star War. After saving the forest from desertification, you head to the Northern Hemisphere. The best hemisphere. No, I don't know. Probably not. My child, a new era is about to begin. There are things that I must take care of in preparation for the coming era. There are also some things that I'm worried about yeah i can see that lucifer seems like a pretty big concern as we found last time the author of all lies has something to do with all of this no don't mind me in any case we shall meet tens of millions of years later in the lands to the east the time of small reptiles is at hand. oh maybe they mean death star as in like you know the meteor that hits and causes the ice age the actual death star the Earth's crust is changing violently and the terrain is undergoing dizzying changes as though the Earth itself were alive. What kind of heresy is that? That's not true at all. Well, let's see what we've got here. We're back to a fairly low... Well, all my Evo genes got erased. That sucks a lot. But uh, let's see what we got going on here. I can walk through... I can actually not touch this... Uh, can I not get down to this healing pond? Well, that's wonderful. So now I should just sit here for a minute and just be surrounded by evil. What's well, going to fight me first? An Ariops? Okay, not too difficult to battle, but we are pretty low on specials again. We're back down to bite, defend, and recover. We don't have the crazy list of moves that we had earlier, but we can start evolving again. And in what direction? Wow! There are a lot of ways we could go off this chart. What do we want to do first? I think maybe let's go in a direction of vitality. Let's get our health up. I think that's probably a good idea. You'll evolve into Cuneosaurus. Cuneosaurus lived in Canada from the, uh, let's see, carnivore. Its ribs sticking out either side were webbed, allowing it to glide. A middle species between lizards and Eosuchia reptiles. Wow, interesting. So I've got I've got wings. I don't think they're going to be terribly useful, however. Uh, how will I do much better fighting an Ariops now? No, I still get pretty unlucky. I don't like that. But I do like being able to recover. That's starting out to be pretty useful. Except when I get unlucky attacked, which... Always... Ooh, I can intimidate people now. Now that I am a Cuaneosaurus. Alright... Let's do another bite. Come on, man. Okay. Yeah, I'm definitely having to use a lot more strategy the farther we get into the game. So, I've got a good amount of health here. Might be worth it to fight. Okay. Is this the healing pond? It does not appear so. The ponds are... The ponds are not very nice, actually. Uh... Hmm. So, which way do we want to go? The map, of course, as we know, is not terribly helpful, so let's go... Let's go up through the... Fo Actually... Hey! A sun temperature rise. That's great. Uh, getting attacked by an Ariops. Not so great. Alright, let's see what, uh... Let's see what, a uh, Let's see what Intimidate does. Um... It jumped over my head? That's kind of weird. I'm gonna bite it, though. It is stunned. Or, did, or am I the one that did the jumping? That must be the, uh... That must be the cause of the intimidation. Yeah, I can just keep on going in on it. Wow. Man, that went really well. Okay, so the temperature rose. A little bit of health loss for the time being. Okay, what are you? Archaeopteryx. No, stop. I'm a good bird. I'm just looking for the black thing that flew down from the eastern skies. 
I th was thinking he could teach me to fly, but I lost sight of him near that steep mountain to the east. So we got a Mount Brave situation type here, don't we? So in EVO The Search for Eden, you could turn into a bird at some point by uh, going to Mount Brave, jumping up off the top of the very highest point of the mountain, taking a leap of faith essentially, and you could turn into a bird. Maybe we'll be able to do something similar here. The game seems to be going roughly the same way. I'm going to follow this trail for now. Why am I Why am I hurt by all the water? Oh, and Arioscalus. That's roughly equivalent to me, so I need to get... Yeah, do lots of... Well, we're going to take each other on pretty... Okay. Intimidating seemed to do quite well against it. Yeah, it's stunned. How many turns is it stunned for? About three. That's... That's not too bad. All right, so yeah, I'm getting the hang of fighting. So I'm actually gonna need to use special moves here and there, I think. Uh, actually, probably incorporate them quite quite uh, well into my uh, regular battle strategy. Let's see, we've got 132 genes now. We can go a whole nother way with this. Um, Wisdom will help us, since we're going to be recovering a lot more, Wisdom is going to be a very useful stat from this point forward. So we're going to take a bunch of that. Oh, we're using five genes at a time when we move. Well, I can imagine so, seeing how many different possibilities of evolution we have here. Yeah, let's pump up to that and then get ourselves some endurance. Okay, that... Let's get roughly equivalent, and then just put the rest into attack for now. Very good. Yes. Alright, keeping it kind of symmetrical on the diamond -y front. What is another Arioscalus? I remember when I was like you. I remember it like it was yesterday. No, wait, actually it was today. What is this little thing just applauding toward me? What is this? Oh, it's a Diadectes, but it has a different skin tone now. But I bet it's just as dangerous, so I'm going to intimidate it. It is stunned. How many turns is it stunned? Hey, a desperate attack. Great. That's four. So anywhere from like three to five, maybe six turns. Okay, yeah. Intimidate is a very good move to use. I can stun somebody for several turns and get a big leg up that way, so I'll have to remember that for the future. Oh, hey, little guy's scrambling toward me, and water currently is not good for healing. Oh, another Diadectes. Okay, I'm close to evolving in either direction, but I think I'm going to take it to attack. And that's going to turn me, that's going to shift me one more to the right. We are now a Mesogallus. What does that mean for us? Okay, looking a little happy. I like the BD little eyes. This character was made specifically for this game and doesn't exist. So I am not anything special. I'm just another fake dinosaur on the on the trail of evolution and life. So let's see how that does for us now. I still have 15 genes. Maybe I could uh, evolve in a direction still? I could take it pretty close to being an endurance monkey, but let's go vitality. I need those hit points. I need to keep everything roughly even. And everything gives good points, so grinding does not take too long. Grinding is really well paced in this game, I must give it that. Okay, yeah, so now they're hurting me a lot less as well. I don't have my Intimidate anymore though, That's that sucks a lot. I'm just gonna snap at the throat, give myself a bit of a leg up there. Anytime they take a defensive stance, I'm gonna use the special and bite. Yeah, that's a perfect time for a big hit. Uh-oh. And anytime they're healing, that's a perfect time for that sort of thing. Ah, oh, man. Unlucky. Absolutely not. Okay, this is not going well for me at all. Okay, I don't like my new evolution. Yeah, the new evolution doesn't have Intimidate, which is a really great move. So, I may want to find a way to turn back into Qanosaurus. This fake dinosaur doesn't have what it takes. He kind of... Oh, here we go. Okay, there's something glowing right here. This looks like a little encampment. I'm going to make my way to it. Uh, again, something that actually hurts me. Uh, a fair lot, actually. Holy moly. 
Everything here hurts so far. Do I have to get to another phase of evolution before these things will actually start working out for me? Wow, volcano eruptions are very generous with their genes nowadays. So let's try... Let's go back... Uh, let's see what wisdom does. Since I don't have Intimidate anymore, I'm definitely going to need to be recovering a lot. Let's go in an Endurance direction, see if I can get back to... Oh, that jumped me all the way over to Arioscolus. That is not... Well, if it has... Uh, if it has Intimidate, then yeah, I'm fine with that. But I think I could do some more evolving here. Now we're a Seamoria. We saw Seamorias back in the... Back in the old times, normally lived in the water, but was able to easily walk on land. A middle species between amphibians and reptiles. <laughs> well, this could just be the whole thing all day until I find something important. But, uh, yeah, so let's go ahead. We can just keep evolving all we want. Let's go... Where does Wisdom jump us to? Wisdom jumps us down a tier to Icarosaurus. Okay, since we're on the next tier, we should probably start really fighting now. Okay, I've got wings. I bet I can intimidate again. Those look very intimidating. First reptile that flew through the air. Glided from tree to tree, catching insects. Okay, very nice. What what happens if I touch this thing now? Nope, still, still a bad thing, mostly. But it's surrounded by torches, which I find interesting. I can't seem to... Oh, no. I do not want to fight you currently. That would be a bad news assignment right there. How about not coming toward me all the time? Oh yeah, can't go in the water either. Nothing is safe. Just gotta sit here and hope nothing attacks me. And a good way to make sure nothing attacks me <laughs> is to keep evolving. Okay, let's go big on attack for now. We're lower on that than just about anything. Well, now we're lower on vitality than just about anything, but... I want to make sure I can chomp things to death. That's always that's always important as well. Uh, aggression is pure aggression is not doing so well for us the farther we get into the game, but it's okay because we have Icarosaurus wings now. We're moving down the victory road. Golly, those things hurt a lot. I guess I could just spend a turn recovering if somebody uh, runs into me. That seems to be the way we want to start off doing this. Boy, okay, everybody is converging on... Everybody is converging on my area. Diadectes, yeah, I definitely want to... Oh, I have a leap now. Does that stun people? Okay, yeah. Unlucky attacks are not going to do me much good. Let me see what leap does. Okay, so that lowers defense because I jump in the air and kick him in the head. That's pretty cool. Okay, yeah, that puts me on a somewhat more even ground with it. I'm going to go ahead and recover some HP. See, it does me no good if I'm getting unlucky attacked, though. There we go. All right, and snap at it. Oh, goodness. These fights get quite tedious once you start introducing strategy. There we go. Okay. All that for 35 Evo genes. Oh, gosh. I hope I can actually escape from things. I would love to have, like, a little healing spot. Hey, that works out. That healed me. That definitely sped up the process. I do not want to fight you, Mesogallus. I want to get around. I do need to do some grinding, maybe, but I want to get to an important thing. Okay, my wisdom is high enough that escaping is kind of a trivial matter. That's that's good. Pe it used to be tough to give people the slip. So tough that my, uh, char my, my little character would curse and stuff. Okay, you are making this path through the mountain pass uh, very difficult, Mr. Diadectes. Uh, that's that looks like another Mesogallus than a Diadectes. Boy, they're gonna they are gonna make this hard on me, aren't they? All right, so I've circled around. Am I going to have to go in the water? I do not want to fight anything. Well, I've healed, though. So, uh... I really don't want to fight just yet. But I think I may have to take some time to grind. Uh, which is... Oh! 
Well, it would make sense that a great blaze enveloped me. I seem to be walking toward just that sort of thing. Uh, can we prevent forest fires? No, but we can uh, certainly... Wow, yeah, this is a... This forest is on fire. I don't know if that's what we want to go toward yet. But we're being blocked by the rocks, so I don't think we have a whole lot of choice. So I'm just gonna... Hey, the temperature rose and I got Evo jeans. That seems to be the best way to get the jeans at this point. Wow, he ran right at me. Let's go ahead and take a turn to recover. Alright, that's not too bad. Let's go ahead and uh, leap to lower their defense. Alright. Oh, very nice. Even the unlucky attacks are not doing much to me at this point. When it takes a defensive stance, that's when we bite. Going really well. Alright. So yeah, I know how it's done now. I, I know pretty much what's up. Uh, 190 genes to spend. Yeah, let me do some grinding, and then we'll then we'll come back when I'm actually at a semi-important point, because I feel like I'm kind of not getting a whole lot done here today. Okay, it looks like wandering into the forest fire actually did get us somewhere. You wandered lost through the mountain range, soaring over the depths of the forest for several months. Then one day you heard an alarming scream. So I just lived at this mountain for a while, that's cool. Alright, so onward we travel then. I can recover, and I can also use this time to heal, and it looks like fight things. So where is the alarming scream? The alarming scream did not come from Dirinosaurus, I don't think. Let's go ahead and recover. Okay. It's unlucky attacks do hurt quite a bit, but I think I'm going to be okay, especially if I lower its uh, defense. So let's just fight until something terrible happens to me. Oh yeah, so it takes the defensive stance. I bite at it. Okay. Nothing is going to happen to... It's going to take a little bit to... Stupid recovery. Dang, come on. Yeah, and see, now I feel like I need to... Well, well now I could just sit here. I defeated the Dorinosaurus, but that doesn't... That's not where the screen... Hey, cool, I can actually rest on the vines. Okay, didn't expect that. That's... Uh, that's a nice little surprise, but there are things on the mountain to be fought still. So I feel like I need to do something to, uh... Come on, man. Share the vine. It's it's my it's my house, too. Okay, well, I'm fully healed in any event, so... Do I need things to take on the things at the top? Wisdom, obviously, for recovery purposes. Put us up to 800 with that. And let's go... Let's go in a hard endurance direction. Okay, well, that's as good as we've got for now. Yes, I like having defense. Having defense is very good. Uh, especially if these things are only doing one hit point of damage to me like others were doing toward the end. Okay, so I have to make my way to the top of the mountain, it would seem. The healing vines are very nice. Oh, I eat the berries on the vines. And, oh, hey, Gaia hearts. Okay, so it's actually worth getting those again, so... So, oh, hey, an actual two-legged dinosaur. He might be dangerous. Uh, I don't know that I want to mess with him right now. Scleramoclus. Well, the first thing, my first thing I'm inclined to do is leap over him and lower his defense. Okay, yeah, he hurts a decent bit. But I do more damage. Okay, we don't like the unlucky attacks. It's already doing defense, so I'm going to take this time to recover then. Ah, oh, come on, really? I would like more of an edge than that. Okay, so in some cases, I think it might behoove me to take a uh, defensive stance time on the enemy's part to recover. Very good. Okay, yep, yeah, I'm going to win this one big now. Alright, and I got 40 Evo genes for beating the two legs. Okay. Alright, any any fruit on the vine? There we go. Alright, let's keep on moving up the mountain then. We want to make sure to stop and get any... Oh, yes, very nice. Very good, very delicious. We definitely will be wanting that and using it immediately. 
give ourselves a wisdom boost to recover more hit points. And then uh, let's go vitality because we need some hit points as well. Let's get up to about 800. Ooh, I can evolve. No. Oh, that canceled everything out. I didn't want to do that. Should have paid a little more attention to what I was doing there. Okay, so how far up do I want to? I want to go up to 845 on vitality. All right, and let's pump up to let's pump up the attack to an evolutionary standpoint. That takes us to Lystrosaurus. Will I be able to leap as a Lystrosaurus? No, but I have the cutest little fangs lived in swamps found in forests similar to modern day hippos. Ate aquatic plants found in and near the water. Okay, well, all right, I'm a little chunky boy. That's fun. Okay, see if I can avoid, see what kind of encounters I can avoid. A Seamoria attacks. What do I have now? I still have my leaping ability, which is good. All right. Oh yeah, Seamorias are not doing anything to me anymore. Oh, they're going to be super easy to take on. Alright, very good. Alright, let's get to the top of this mountain. A Cuneosaurus. Alright. Can I do the leap thing to you? Does that work? It does. And it doesn't even make a dent in me, so that wasn't anything even... Oh, well. It can try snapping in my throat, but stunning me and making me sit still but that does nothing for it all right let's continue making our way up the mountain then i think i went this way last time and ran to a dead end or am i wrong do i want to go up the vine in the sky i think i do yep i pretty much definitely do want to go that way there we go Let's climb across the sky vines. It's not intimidating at all, I promise. Reaching the birds now, what do they have to say? Hey, good climb. I'm an Archaeopteryx. My dream for the future is to fly freely through the skies. I'm trained to fly at this very moment. Just like that black thing at the top of the mountain. People keep bringing up the black thing. What's the black thing? Yee, ouch. I fell. Not as good as the black thing. We all want to be the black thing, don't we? Seems like a real point of contention. I heard an awful cry coming from above. I wonder who it was. Maybe it was <gasps> the black thing? Just a guess. Uh, can I walk along the clouds? I cannot. I am not as good as the black thing yet. Ah, as I suspected, the black thing is very UFO-like in nature. Save me! Save me! Save me! A small creature is being attacked by medium-sized reptiles. You startled the reptiles with your sudden arrival, and they ran away, because boss encounters are not really something this game is, you know, into the whole idea of. That was close. I'm a Lunarian, a denizen of the moon. Oh, boy. I had engine troubles at the warp zone near those three glowing mountains to the east. Had to make an emergency landing, and here I am. Lady Lucifer offer, ordered me to come to this planet on a reconnaissance mission. Why are you telling me this? This seems like classified info. I'm sure Lady Lucifer would not appreciate this. We're the only ones left to protect the planets of the solar system since the Venusians and Martians were destroyed. It's a huge responsibility. That's right. I have a present here from Lady Lucifer herself. Try heading due east from here. I know it'll help you with your evolution. Is Lucifer's help the kind of help I want? My thanks to you, little reptile. Looks like he gave me a bunch of Evo genes. Is that it? Yeah, looks that that looks to be the case. Oh man, we have lots of Evo genes to spend. Holy moly! But I think at the top of this mountain is a good place to rest. Uh, let's take in the view, which is even better than the view that the Anubisaurus Forest Guardians had. And uh, we will come back next time, and uh, and uh, use some of lady lucifer's present really <laughs> satan and martians okay still trying to wrap my mind around it a little